What's up guys? So I want to upload this video showing you guys uh, the location where I was assaulted sexually August 5th um, between the hours of 1.30 a.m. and 4 a.m. Um, I'm showing you guys this particular location so that you can see that there is a camera right on the building. So there's the camera right there, right there, you can see. And this is at a um, restaurant called Cafe uh, Tokyo. And um, like I said, I don't typically frequent there, but uh, it doesn't really matter where I go. This is something that follows me. I want to show you guys the pattern that I deal with when it comes to um, catching this crime on surveillance cameras outside in public places. Uh, this is the parking lot, like I said, and right across the street there is a coffee shop that I'm going to zoom in in here just a second. And there's a camera on that particular building as well. And, uh, once I took the, the video for this, I went into the building that is where the camera is located and proceeded to talk to someone about uh, the incident and the camera. Now, when I got there, there was a, a, a Mexican guy that was really, really anxious and he just was really, 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 really interested in trying to help me. And this is the person that I'm talking to. And he was really trying to discourage me from to leave the building and letting me know there's no one there, there's no security. He's the maintenance guy, so whatever it is that I need, I should talk to him. And I right off the bat knew that he was somebody that knew what had happened to me and was the one who was going to be in charge of covering it up as far as like not letting me see the cameras and not going to the camera system and saying that he's seen anything himself. So uh, in this part here, I'm gonna show you guys me talking to him. So like I said, he comes out, he's trying to assist me and I'm, I'm constantly telling him that I wanted to speak to the security uh, guy that works there. There's a security guy that works there, he's on post and he had stepped away from his uh, post and I was standing at the post waiting and he just kept popping out. The first time I didn't get it recorded but the second time I did record it, because he just kept popping out, you know, insisting on trying to help me. And then you know, I think it was like, this is the second time that he popped out. And when he popped out, he was like, you know, there's not gonna be anybody in from security today. So whatever it is, you know, I'm maintenance, I can help you. And I was like, well, I don't think so. Not if you're maintenance, like you're not in charge of the security surveillance cameras, you're not security. So as he's trying to like get rid of me, once again, a security officer starts walking in the door and so I was like all right so I'll get him to help me so you're you're good you're dismissed you know go ahead but he ended up continuously interfering the security guy that ended up showing up was new and so he was just taking the orders from this maintenance dude and I didn't end up getting getting to see the cameras and they kept saying that there was nothing on the cameras this is what he told the, the, the uh, security guy so just pay attention. Well, no, you're not keeping me waiting. I just choose to try to talk to someone that's actually going to be able to help me in this area. Like I said, you're well, maintenance. And I just asked her, she said that you are maintenance over the building, but that you're not in charge of anything over the building. Well, I want to let you know that this number is for the phone that's in that office, and there will be no security here today. Why? So why is that? waiting all day. And why is that? They're, the, the, they're short staff, and um, they can't get no help from, from... Really? They can't get nobody to cover the ship. So is there anything that I can do for you? you're going to be waiting all weekend. No, no, no. I'll just call this number. If I can't call this number, I'll get a hold of someone around the building here this just gonna gonna go to the phone that's in the I just heard you I just heard you I just said I'll just call this number or I'm gonna just try to wait and see if I can speak to someone that's actually in charge maybe a manager someone like that and that of that nature of the building there's, there's no manager here. I can always look it up on Google like I said I mean I don't want to help you know someone trying to help me that can't help me you know what I mean okay oh well we have, we have one right awesome here, so. thank you but I think that's his first 
It's okay. I just didn't want to talk to maintenance because, like I said, he can't help me with what I'm asking for. Okay. Yeah. The normal guy was here Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Yeah. Not Thursday. Yeah. In this case, you're pregnant. And normally, like, there's a sign there that says that if they're not here, those the signs are not here. I know. I was trying to call him yesterday. And Nobody? Nope. Well, hopefully he can help. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, about uh, the building and something that, that, that took place that I wanted to speak to someone that was over the security cameras. Oh, yeah, this is my 